Yeah, um, I'd say today I, I ran on my best there. Mm. It was not like 100% for me, but the condition, you see, the condition make me run slow because, you see, it was muddy, it was a lot of, it was still windy, it was cold. So you all those three conditions, it just comes and affected my game, my game plan of running on. But I'm happy, I know I'm, I'm still the best and it doesn't disappoint me because I ran very well. I took it, I took it as fast as I, I wanted to, it was there. Uh, until, the, until the last 8K where I came in there, where we have like a lot of wind blowing up, that's the place I came to fail because that place was fell bad, I was stuck in the mud then the guy came and passed me that I couldn't do anything but I'm proud of what I did today, I did very well. Yeah, yeah cross country season is over now, I go home, take um, a little break like two weeks and then start running my, start doing my easy runs then come to Christmas I start doing speed workout for I, I'll be still training for the indoor training. I, I'm just focused on my training for the indoor because in the indoor season, the shape I will have in indoor determines how I'll be in the outdoor season. Yeah. So I, it doesn't mean I don't have indoor. I'll go stay home and just relax and stay there without training. I'm just to go and train as the same as I trained the other years. Yeah. So when it comes outdoor, indoor, I can just run like home meets. I can just test myself and see how it goes. Then it come outdoor and be ready for outdoor season. Yeah, I'm extremely proud of the way he went into this race and performed. And uh, really, the race was the way it was because of him. He led uh, almost the entire race. Um, the lead pack was basically right behind him during all the windy parts, the hardest parts, uh, the muddy parts. They're all just right behind him, kind of keying off of him. So he helped make the race what it was. But uh, you'd like for to, someone to win when you have to do all that work. But uh, he just came up a little bit short today uh, at the very end, but um, gave it everything he had. And, and that's even when he's doing all the winning, you know, being undefeated in cross country after this race. I mean, he knows, you know, when you're going to put him in a competition, he's going to do everything he can and run as fast as he can. And he did that today and just happened to, to lose to another really good athlete. Yeah, definitely set a new bar for us. And uh, he's going to have to keep looking up to that bar and trying to move it up even higher. But uh, just the attitude, the work ethic, everything that he is to a student athlete um, as he's brought to Texas Tech has been fantastic and has just been a great leader for our program.